What's up guys, it is Sweets, back with another video. In this video, I'll be showing you how to install the Crack Launcher for Minecraft Beta 1.7.3 and Beta 1.1 so you can join the Soldier Project and Beta Lands my server. Alright, so first off, go into this folder I'm going to leave below. Um, if you want to download it from the Soldier Project, go into the uh, link below, nostalgiaproject.net slash download. Um, but first off, if you want to download the Beta 1.7.3 files, click this. Um, and then go into here put contents from here into dot minecraft and uh, what you're gonna have to do is go to dot minecraft so go start go to percent app data percent um, go to dot minecraft and uh, if you already have a bin folder in there it's probably old or you know if you haven't sold anything from there um, just drag it to your desktop so you know it doesn't delete anything like if you have mods or something um, just back it up um, but for now just um, keep this and uh, drag the rest of the stuff into your .minecraft and replace so yeah replace and uh here we go and you're gonna want resources too because oh my minecraft is open is it no it's not all right but uh the resources basically brings back the old textures as well so it's pretty cool and then we can open up the .minecraft or the minecraft.exe and then uh the launcher that's the same thing it's simple um, I'm gonna type in end username. I'm gonna type in uh, sweets papa because I'm a savage. Hit login, and if it doesn't say play offline or it's grayed out, they they can't click it. Um, that you didn't install this right, so it's probably because the bin isn't in there or in the right folder. So that's probably why. Um, then click play offline. Uh, since it's beta 1.7.3. You can type in my IP for my server. Why is that shit in there? Um, go to betalands.com. And uh, it's new. What the hell? Where am I? The fuck? Whoa. Where the fuck am I? Alright, um. I think the slash spawn was removed on accident. So, uh. Welcome to spawn. <laughs> All right. Uh, well, yeah, this is the spawn for now. I'm gonna have to fix that. Oops. <laughs> All right. So this is the spawn. This is Trinity, or what was Trinity, now called Pentrad. I don't know why it's called that, but yeah. Um, and I'm gonna disconnect. Now we're gonna install the beta 1.1 um, crack launcher. So it is in this folder already. Oh no, it's not. Okay. Oh, I can't. Yeah, okay, there we go. Um, so this uh, WinZip folder, if we open that, it should have this in there. Uh, is this right? No, it's all right, never mind. No, this is the jar file. All right, so if we put the thing in the bin, right? No, that's wrong, actually. Um, I think that's Optifine. All right, so we're gonna have to like, go to nostalgiaproject.net forward slash download. It downloads it automatically and this fixes the skins as well for beta 0.1 now we can open this um, JSON oh uh, what does it just have the JSON uh, oh wait no um, oh okay well apparently they don't want you using crack launchers, so uh, for an installer project, just go to oh, oops, um, go to your dot Minecraft, go to versions. You have to have the new Minecraft launcher, um, and then for the installer project dot JSON, drag that into or just copy and paste the beta 1.7.3, rename that nostalgia project because you know this it's called nostalgia project dot JSON. Rename this nostalgia. Nostalgia project and then delete this, drag this in there, and it's good, should be done. All right, and then uh, we start up Minecraft. Actually, I did that wrong because I wanted it to be beta 1.1, not beta 1.7.3. So, I'm gonna have to redo that. Add go down to beta 1.1, uh, yeah, right here. 
and launch it so we have a fresh download here it is so once it downloads I can exit out all right there we go and uh, just go f5 and then copy that drag it into here the 1.7 or nostalgia project and delete nostalgia project jar rename it to nostalgia project all right there we go and then uh, go back into Minecraft and we can launch the nostalgia project um, folder if it's in there it's not in there let's add it where is that uh, here it is okay there we go and then it's right there download and we're good I think the JSON for nostalgia project fixes a few, a few things can't talk on the list because I'm so tired. Project.net. Pretty sure that's IP or play.nostalgiaproject.net. So that nostalgia. .net. I'm not whitelisted, I don't think. Oh, it's not whitelisted anymore. Alright, but yeah, it's pretty cool. Uh so that's basically it. And uh there's nothing really else to show. Um I just want to show you guys that because for bid on point seven point three, it really helps. Um for installing texture packs because I don't think you can use patch texture packs without the correct launcher um, and then or maybe yeah I don't think you can you can't use MC patcher with the crack or the without the crack launcher um, and then mods the same thing you can't use um, mods without the correct launcher some other things too the crack launcher is just very useful very universal um, also MC um, something it's a pretty good launch right i'll probably do another video on that i don't know what it's called at this moment but yeah so that's basically it i hope you guys enjoyed if you did make sure to like comment subscribe i'll see, I'll see you guys later peace out thanks for watching